G'day folks, Dean with OnlineToolReviews.com here again. Uh, just a very quick video on changing the blades on a Stanley 10788 utility knife. Uh, there's been a lot of problems I guess with users that can't seem to, to change the blades on, the, on this particular model very easily. So this is how it's done. Um, first you must um, advance the blade as far as it'll go. There is a final notch here at this position um, but you actually have to push that down again and push that as far as far as far forward to the front as possible um, that position there won't work um, as you can see the blade is still stuck in the knife um, but if we push that all the way forward so it's as far as it'll go in in that um, slot here and then we should be able to just push this yellow button in uh, you don't need to put a lot of force on this particular knife um, but just push that in and the blade will slide all the way out um, quite easily so with the blade out um, just reinserting it is the opposite of taking it out so again just making sure that um, top uh, top button is, is advanced as far forward as it'll go and pressing the yellow button will just carefully slide that blade back in just try and get it square if you can so it slides in and then I like to just um, uh, when we when we get it into the holder there just let go of that and then just further advance it until you hear that click I'll just do that again you might be able to hear that click on on the video so there it is there and that's pretty secure in, into that um, first notch in the blade um, and then of course always just retract the blade all the way back and make sure the blade is fully enclosed and, and it's not um, uh, poking out or, or um, coming out of, out of the blade just for safety and we can see there that the blade is, is available there for the, the twine and string cutter there so that's basically how you do it um, button forward push that yellow blade in uh, yellow button in sorry extract the blade and to reinsert it, um, we can flip it around just for the purpose. Uh, reinsert that carefully. And just once we get it in there, push in till we hear that click. Again, that little click. And then retract the blade. And they're all done. It's, it's quite simple. The, the main thing is this um, uh, button here and the slide mechanism has to go all the way forward there. Um, back in that first position there, that first indent is not sufficient. It's got to be pushed all the way forward and then you can extract the blade.